Welcome, everybody. It's Turbo Terminator here, and I'm back playing Red Dead Redemption 2. It is a wonderful day. The weekend of Thanksgiving. Please excuse my poncho, everybody. I look like a horrendous mess this morning. I hope everyone's doing well, and I hope uh, everybody had a wonderful Thanksgiving. I certainly did. Lots of food. I've been stuffed. I've been in a turkey coma for the last couple days. Um, that's, that's like one crazy thing. I love making, uh, making big turkeys, uh, for Thanksgiving every year. This year I made a 28 pound turkey. Um, so I have a lot of leftovers and I eat the leftovers shoot for like a week after, uh, like literally every day, almost every meal. And I like live in this perpetual state of like turkey coma. Like I'm always drowsy and I'm always like... <laughs> I'm always like super tired. Uh, it was terrible. So much food. What was the best side dish that you had? Unless of the turkey beat it out, but everyone says it's about the sides. In my opinion, it's always about the turkey. I want to fix my green screen while you answer that in the game loads. But uh, yeah, for me, I would definitely say it was a turkey. I did. Uh, I did a few other things. Uh, this Thanksgiving. Okay, I'm good. I did a few or a, a few different things this uh this Thanksgiving. Just more or less like uh, I got the cooking aspect down of everything, and I was just more or less just trying to like how can I spruce things up. That was me the past few days. Mashed potatoes. I um. So what I do with my mashed potatoes, and I might have gotten this from you, Code Mars. I forget. Um, I did five pounds of russet potatoes, and I did five pounds of Yukon gold potatoes. And uh, I made them homemade, mashed them up. Um, I threw a, bit, a little bit of cream cheese in there. I threw like a stick of cream cheese in there. And, uh, obviously, like, butter. And, uh, come on, dude. I want some coffee. Hurry up and pour it. Dude! That echoed. Pour the coffee, bro. Jeez. All right, so... How is the apple and the bird? Um, oh, so, okay, so I stuffed the bird with a Fuji apple, um, some sage, some thyme, and some parsley. Unfortunately, I went, I, w I was too late. Oh, excuse me. Let me get out of the way for you. Watch this. Why are you crowding me? <laughs> I just threw a bunch of coffee on, on her dress. Um, so yeah, so I stuffed it with that. I couldn't find any rosemary, which is what you're like supposed to be putting in the bird as well. But uh, I'm just going to do some chores here in the uh, little camp while we talk. This is the second camp in uh, in Red Dead Redemption. I asked Bill to do that. So no spoilers because I haven't played this for a while. <clears throat> Uh, something causes you guys to have to move camps. But they kind of mention that in the trailers and everything. Anyway, so uh, it was actually pretty good. Uh, the bird was very moist. Um, I, what I do when I prepare the bird is uh, I will melt a bunch of butter. Probably like a stick of butter or so. Sometimes maybe even two sticks. And I will... Um, Put a bunch of herbs that I have in the kitchen in there. Parsley, basil, thyme, rosemary, uh, a little bit of Goya seasoning, some garlic and onion powder. Um, and then I'll mix it all in with the butter, as the butter's melted, that is. And then I'll take a... I'll, I'll put my hand under the skin of the turkey. What chapter are you at? I want to say I'm in chapter 3. Is there a way to find out? I'm at 37%. I 
don't know if that that tells me progress. Twenty eight percent story. But um I separate the skin from the uh, breast of the bird and uh, I'll get a baser and I'll shoot a bunch of, of the herb butter in there and kind of like massage it so it gets all over the turkey breast under the skin. And then uh, I'll leave like a pool of it under there as well just so it kind of soaks in when the, when the meat is cooking. And then, um, then, I'll, then I'll rub the outside of it and then after I uh, rub down the outside of it uh, for a little bit of color, I'll uh, throw a little bit of paprika on the top of it. And then just some more additional herbs. It's usually like Hello. like parsley and stuff like that. Just, uh, just to give it a little bit of show color before I put it in the oven. And then I'll bake it at 350. Good morning, Arthur. Um, until desired color is on there morning arthur morning and then i'll and then i'll cover it up the rest of the way make herb butter and put that under the skin yeah that's the best that's the best way for me in my opinion to uh to get a, a nice and uh moist turkey breast it's really good and it's worked uh for a very long time for me so it's something that that uh has worked well I could only fit with a 28 pound bird. I can only fit one Fuji apple in there. My father was telling me that I might be able to fit two, but there's no way in heck that I could fit uh, two apples in there and all the rest of the stuff. But it was it was pretty good. It I don't feel like it it gave like a, a taste at all to it, but it did help keep the the bird moist. So I I, I thought that was good. But I don't do stuffing, so I felt like stuffing the bird with like herbs and stuff is a uh, is a better way to uh, enhance a little bit of the herb butter flavor, as well as uh, uh, show make it look a little make it look a little better as well. All right, this is the last chore, and then we'll go do some stuff. Um, this outfit is called the Gambler Outfit. It was an expensive, expensive outfit. I did not pay for it, though. Um, if you run around... Thanks, Arthur. Pearson was moaning about those. No problem. If you uh, rescue some people who have been bitten by snakes, uh, the, if you eventually run back into them in front of, like, general stores or, like, uh, or really any stores in uh in random towns they will uh tell you thanks for saving you saving them oh can i ask you a favor if, if it's convenient i mean sure if you're out on your adventures and you see any herbs for seasoning speaking about herbs them for <clears throat> me? seasoning yes don't tell mr pearson <laughs> <laughs> okay i'll see what i can do all right, can I check and see if I've got those herbs? I guess not. Okay. Maybe I don't have those herbs yet. But yeah, so if you come across people just as you're riding your horse and uh, you hear people screaming for help, yes, this can bite you in the butt sometimes because uh, some people will try to rob you. But uh, some people have been bitten by snakes and they ask for your help. And if you help them, give them uh, the a cure... If you give him whiskey, I gave this one dude whiskey once, and he died. So, whiskey isn't the... Or, like, bourbon or whatever. Some kind of alcohol. And it's just like, here's alcohol. Today? Like, go ahead and die now. Um, so, that didn't help him. But he ended up buying me this suit. And then, uh, I can't look at my guns right now. But I got this volcanic pistol from another shop. Let's see. This is the look I've been going for. His hair isn't palmated though. I need to I need to actually get a haircut. But I'll keep the mustache at a four. Oh. Here we go. Keep the mustache at a four. And then clean shaven all around. I want him to look like Ron Swanson. <clears throat> oh. 
Okay. There's fishing over there. Let's see what we have. Bill Williamson. Bill needs to speak to you. Ooh, that looks like we're going to rob a bank. We should do that. I'm up to, like, this area where, like, these two families are feuding. And uh, Dutch doesn't want us using any weapons in these areas. Uh, what's this? Jeremiah. Break into Jeremiah Compson's house and recover his possessions. Oh, I should do that, too. Uh, I think that's good. Yeah, we're not going back to Blackwater. All right, so let's do... We'll do the Bill one, and then we'll do the Jeremiah one. I don't want to. I don't want to spoil too much story if you guys are playing Red Dead. Oh, I forgot to show you. <clears throat> Uh, I didn't realize this the la uh, like what I don't know if it was the last time I was streaming this game or if it was the first time I was streaming the game I didn't know I was dumping all this money into like the the camp the crew but I didn't realize uh, let's see if I have any items Oh, I think I'm saving all these now. Um, I didn't realize that uh, there was this ledger here. And the letter, the ledger will essentially have a breakdown of like <clears throat> what you deposited. Um, looks like Charles dropped 250 in there. Karen brought in a gold tooth. I don't want to ask how she found that. Um, but you can update uh, the medicine wagon. You can update the provisions wagon. Um, as you can see in the upper right hand corner, my ammo is low because I need to uh, restock that. Um, and I don't need to because my ammo, my personal ammo is really high. And then the lodging is uh, is important. It's 220 to get Dutch's thing comfort like uh, like uh, just for show that Dutch is more comfier. Then the next line is that uh, Arthur wants a map to help with his journeys for 325. That one will actually activate fast travel if you're interested in fast travel. I bought the wrong thing yesterday. Oh, no. And my green screen decided to trickle on and off. Oh, let me fix that. I don't know if that's been <clears throat> going the whole time. Oh, boy. Green screen. This is going to happen <clears throat> as the sun comes up. Let's just do green. What you read? Evelyn Miller, of course. <laughs> that old windbag. Um, He's no windbag, son. He is and then you can buy these senior. things, which, in my opinion, a lot of these aren't super essential, but they're here. The horse station, the chicken coop, um, uh, camp boat, which you won't get until the second camp. Uh, and then the leather working tools, so, um, so Pearson can make more things. I've hunted and caught a few legendary, uh, Mr. Miller has a, way of putting a few legendary animals, Are but not. Oh. Well, I'm alive, Miss Grimshaw. These girls, Mr. Morgan, they're driving me to despair. Why? No gratitude and no manners. This younger generation, it saddens me. These dang youngins. Is that it? Oh wait, wait! I got your request. Here we go. Here's those herbs you asked for. Ah, uh, excellent! Thank you. I'll flip these in Pearson's pot when he's not looking. Oregano. All right. <clears throat> so this is my morality meter. I am pretty much a good boy. With the exception of um, robbing people once and, and again. So this game will uh, let you loot bad guys who try to shoot you. Arthur, but uh, you. if you loot 
just innocent bystanders. Like if you see that dude get kicked by his horse and you loot him, then you lose a, a little bit of morality. What, Bill? What is it? We got something cooking. You the time just changed. Am I gonna like the sound of this? Been cooking since horseshoe, but you went and kicked up all that commotion at Valentine. Now we was preparing to rob the bank there until you got involved in all that nonsense, and I don't know. I just feel like it's unfinished business. That wasn't my fault. It was just one of them things. How come every time I get in trouble, I'm called a fool and an idiot? But when <laughs> you get in trouble, oh, it's just one of them things. <laughs> it's a good point, Arthur. A very good point. All right, come on, stop ganging right, up on well, me. What do y'all want me to do? Hit the <clears throat> goddamn bank with us. <laughs> You really think it's worth going back there? Four of us can hit the bank easy, but I ain't gonna lie to you. There will be law if we linger. And if we're serious? No, just local boys being rounded up and pressed into action. Meaning? If we go in quick and quiet, we can hit it just fine. If there's four of us, I mean. Y'all think it's worth the risk? It's a bank, Let's do it. Arthur. I want some cash. So, is the take good? According to the fella I met, yes. It's the end of the stock sales. Plenty of money and plenty of people milling about. <sighs> okay, I suppose. It's worth taking a look at least. I'm gonna be performing. I better go get changed out of these rags. Give me a minute, gentlemen. Okay. So, Bill, this better be good. It is good. We put a lot of research into this one. I hope so. So there is a point when I was playing. Mr. Morgan. I'm a good boy. Leave me alone. Next task. <laughs> that man. The data, Thomas Downs, apparently he's dead. Dead? Huh. Well, then he didn't seem very well. His wife. I believe he has a wife and child. She will assume the debt, of course. Of course. Then you can head up there and collect. We lent them a lot of money. Okay. Gentlemen, let's go rob ourselves a bank. Oh, What's boy. the plan, then? Oh, well, we're gonna send Karen on in ahead as a uh, distraction. Then we're just gonna rush on in afterwards. Just a small bank in a little town. Nothing that big in way of security. <laughs> We just need to bring you along as a insurance policy. Yeah, that sounds about right. So this is All where right. we get into some trouble, because last time I was in Valentine, I found the, that O'Driscoll uh, operating in the back of the uh, doctor shop, and I ended up killing almost the entire town on accident. And I streamed that. So <laughs> that didn't turn out well. Tell me again about this big can't go wrong plan of yours. Oh, it can go wrong. Anything can, once the shooting starts. Well, that's reassuring. Also, like what said, you can do, too, is we'll you can turn on the cinematic looks. camera. Oh. If we can get in all right, we'll send Miss Jones ahead to the bank. Most of the time, they you can turn on the cinematic camera, and you don't have I'll to hold the X button down. Well, what excuse me, depending on whatever your system you're playing on. Uh, you don't have to hold it down. Girl. And Nobody your horse will just go to wherever like GPS me. destination you have set on your map. I have a 300 it. bounty. We'll yeah, I made sure I paid when all I those. The place the other day, there was only a couple of guards. We deal with I love cinematic them. camera. It's the best. I didn't fully understand it when I was first playing it, but now it's great. Oh, yeah, I use it all the time, too. Right, Arthur? Now I see why you brought me. Hey, I'm more than willing. Looks like I need a bath. Best I do it. Oh, and did Dutch tell you I've also been cooking up some deals with them gray boys? What? No. Also, what there was a time where I stumbled on See, a ghost train. Realize, uh, I, I walked on and everybody was gone. You. Everything was looted. I don't know if it's considered a ghost now. train, but nobody was on it. Secure. Nobody was there. There was no I'm dead bodies. Sure uh, just everybody was gone. It was just sitting anymore. on the track. So I got on well, the front and I started driving it. And I drove it to the next like train no station. I was like honking right the horn. Now. I just saw that boat yes, out there. I, know, Morgan. I wonder if I can get on that boat. But yeah, so that was that was kind of fun. I was like, oh, a train. Let me rob it. I put my mask on and I was looking through all the stuff and nothing was there. And I was like, what? And then I started going through the cars because I started at the caboose. And, like, nobody was there. Although there was another time where I rode by um, the O'Driscolls robbing a train. So I figured maybe that's what happened. They, they probably robbed the train. And when I wasn't around, I just stumbled on the remains. But interesting nonetheless. I saw deer 
eating another deer before. I don't know if it was a if I got the video in time. That's crazy. I've never seen that. I've never seen like another animal like eating another animal in the game. Oh, look at that. Look how beautiful that is. Uh, also, what you can do too is like if you see smoke in the distance, you can always follow that smoke, and it's usually like a one person camp. Oh, look at those buffalo. And uh, you can usually rob them. I usually rob them and tie them up, but if they try to be aggressive towards me, I'll kill them. It was like a coyote in a deer skin. Weird. It attacked me and ran off. What the hell? Was it a was it a cougar or something? Cause I got killed by a cougar once. I also captured one, but I mean like like one. I didn't know what it was. This dude was screaming, and I took my gun out and I came up and I didn't see it in enough time because it like jumped and dove on me, and killed me in one hit. After this mission, I'll show you guys my guns, too. Because I've been upgrading my guns, also. It was death a deer. Wow. Interesting. Oh, another thing I found out. The fencing the fencing guy that, uh, like, you can sell stagecoaches to. Uh, he won't take prisoner carts. <laughs> I travel, like, across the map to because to, I stumbled on this prisoner cart and he's like I don't want to buy that and I'm like oh man it went all this way here we go I've been to Valentine in a, in a bit she used to be my old stomping grounds. I used to play poker for like full 24 game hours in the saloon. If you watch videos with um, Red Dead Redemption 2 glitches, it's pretty funny. I haven't seen anything crazy on my end. Just like hands going weird and stuff like that, but. <clears> or <throat> just funny moments. There was this one where this dude stopped on a horse to help this woman who was saying that she like twisted her ankle and needed help or something. And uh, all of a sudden a goat came out of nowhere and like plowed into her and killed her. Alright. So this is my beautiful volcanic pistol but I'll I'll show you guys later when this mission's done so I can actually like clean it and stuff Good morning Hello there Howdy You well then Okay let's leave the horses here off the main drag All right gentlemen here we are Okay, get ready. All right, do I have my weapons? Okay. Yeah. No, I don't have. Go to work. Of course. Can I not get my weapons? It's fine, I guess. All right, keep it cool and follow me, fellas. I didn't even know there was a bank so, here. We never decided. Is it lost little girl you want or the drunken harlot? Uh, I think I'd like to see the little girl lost. So even you long to save the fallen women, eh, Arthur? Uh. You break my heart. You really do. <laughs> if you're ready, get going. Good luck, gentlemen. We got there. 
us. Are they waiting on me? Okay, we're going. No, uh, hold on. Wait till she's gone real dead. Get your goddamn right. hands up! Go. This is right. a goddamn robbery! Nobody move! Get word up! Nobody move! Don't make us hurt you! Here! Unlock the door! It's unlocked! We're good! Over this one. Oh, you think we're here for Come on. Open the goddamn vault. Open it. Just open the goddamn door. How's it looking? Are you in? Nearly. This son of a bitch needs to get a move on. Okay. Okay. Get a move on. I'm gonna beat his ass. Too goddamn slow. Open that door up. Uh. Uh. Open it up. Come on. Okay. Oh my god, dude. Get in the bank. I'm in. Someone come make sure the suit behaves himself in here. Come here. <laughs> Open the lock boxes now. I. Uh, the, the, the manager does that. Uh, I. God damn it. Now what? Guess I'll crack them or blow them up. Keep an eye out. I'll be as quick as I can. Yeah, I think I should be able to crack these. All right, but you oh. better be quick. All right, you what happened shut here? shut the hell up and stay still. God, this is going to make a ton of noise. Rip to this safe dial. Okay, come that's the on, first time we've done that. On. Take it all, baby. How much time do you think we got? I don't know. Oh my God, that was a ton of money. How are you getting off? Going as fast as I can. This is slower, but it's quiet. Okay. I hear people out there. Me too. Boys, you need to move this along. Come on. I don't know how many we can loot, but I'm going to try to loot as many as I can. How's it looking there? God, there's so much money. Good. Told you. Don't count your chickens just yet. Yeah, I have a feeling this is going to turn into a firefight. I won't say nothing. I swear. Shut the hell up and stay where you are. We're getting there. Few more minutes. Come on. I'm going to be mad if a ton of this goes into the uh, the camp money, which I'm assuming that it will, because I've bought That's everything already. Cleared. This is looking good. How much longer? Nearly there. Okay, you reckon that's enough now? Maybe. It's never enough. Well... I'm ready to get the hell out of here whenever you are. Okay. F9. 
for this one more. Last one. Good. We gotta move. That had a lot and it had five thousand in it. This is crazy. I'm gonna walk away with like twenty thousand. Come on. The slower you go, the better. Because I've noticed I've passed over numbers. I've had to go back around a second time. There we go. I'm glad he's showing me his, his fingers to let me know. <laughs> All right. I don't have to lo loot anything else. I feel like that's good. That's five grand right there. I think, uh, I think we're fine. Come on, I'll lead the way. Let's go. Everybody, stay calm. All of you count to a hundred and keep your mouth shut. You understand me? Probably close the door. How did I just get good Samaritan stuff? I guess because I didn't kill any of them. Oh shoot. And look, look, over there. Oh, come on. I was right next to my horse. Oh, I don't want to skip this. All right. All right, let's get out of here. I prefer not to get a bounty. Oh, they want me dead or alive. That's not good. Sorry, buddy. My Dakota horse is super fast. Where are we going? Don't make me kill any of y'all. Oh no, we're going the wrong way. Kid me. gotten a little bit better with my shooting <laughs> now that I know how to use the dead eye <clears throat> oh my dead eye super low too do something with the horse Look out. Oh, wrong thing I don't want a double fist Something happened to him. I think the horse fell over. Oh, is there a train coming? Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, there's a train coming. Ah! Man, that was close. It was close. Well, I might have to use some of this money to, uh, <laughs> for my bail money. 
That was stupid and dangerous. Thank you, Bill. <laughs> we're alive and we're paid. Yeah. I don't see the problem. Yeah, and that is the problem. <laughs> Bill, Thank this you. is a very good take. That you'll be happy, even if it did come with a heap of trouble. Ah, it was fun. <laughs> Maybe you're right. Now, go on, get out of here. I have some other business to attend to. Don't head directly back to camp. And make sure you ain't followed. Aren't they going right back to camp? This is down. Alright, so let's go uh, back to camp. Right to Downs Ranch. Why are we going to Downs Ranch? Oh my gosh, really? Oh, because he wants me to <clears throat> to check on that woman who owes us money. So let me look at the guns real quick. So can I not check it? Maintain R three. Maybe I had to have it out. I don't know why it's not doing it. All right, well. Let's just go to the to the ranch. Get a cinematic camera here. Just press X a couple times so that your horse is going at a decent speed. And then there. You don't have to touch the controller. And your horse is basically just GPSing to the location you want to go to. You done good, girl. This actually looks like uh This actually looks like the old stomping grounds, this area. Where we first put up our camp. Alright, she can slow down a little bit. I don't want her to Why am I taking my gun out? I have shot. <laughs> Thank you, Scrappy Vision, for the follow. I appreciate it, my friend. Um, I have, I have shot a fish with uh, a pistol. Um, <laughs> it comes out as a very poor fish. I have shot at a fish with an arrow, so you can actually get the fish that are close to the shoreline with uh, with guns and arrows. Um, in those types of chases that I just had where like you've got a bunch of people chasing after you what I've done in the past <laughs> is if they're all in a line behind you what hold on what's going on I saw a flash let's make sure our horse is doing well we need energy hello scramby vision so we got some Oh, we had some animals here. Yeah. Oh, I'm not going the right way. Where are you going? But yeah, so I want to think about the legendary things that I've caught. I don't know if these are considered legendary, but I know they're like part of the the guide. All right, here she is. Um, I got a buffalo. I've got uh, the white wolf. I've gotten like the big buck. A couple different things. All right, I'm not gonna gra I'm not gonna walk up to her with the gun, but I mean I'm gonna have it just in case. Have you hunted a legendary buck yet? I want to see. Let me see. Is there a way to see that? Maybe under progress. So I've got the white-tailed buck, white-tailed deer, American bison, um, the wild boar, a cougar. I guess I just pet those pups. There's the Rocky Mountain bull elk, Rocky Mountain cow elk, American red fox, Canada goose, mule, 
muskrat. Some of these obviously I haven't hunted. I just kind of like checked on. Honor map. If you kill the buck, you'll have a crown on it. It'll be scratched out. Oh, on the legendary, on the legendary one. All right, so let me see. Forget which one's a satchel. Oh, that's a journal. Okay, so documents. What is with this? Why is it not doing it? Open. X. Use. I'll check in a minute. The regular map. Oh. Alright, so I guess not that. Not seeing any animals crossed out. God, this map is so huge. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I didn't. I know that I, uh, I was able to use some with Pearson, so maybe well, I didn't get him. Maybe I was confused. You come back here, Archie. I nearly paid off what was owed. Your husband knew the rules when he took that money. Now I'm real sorry about the way things turned out, but he had a choice. Ain't my fault about the way the world is. It's on he the west side. Choice. Okay, I'll check it. He was good, and he did good. There wasn't no choice in that. And you was good as killed him yourself. And don't kid yourself. What? You had a choice. You speak I beat as him, him a couple times. Something I cared about. You ever wonder about eternity? You should. I hope it's hot and terrible, Big Mrs. Valley. Downs. Okay. Otherwise, I'll feel I've been sold a false bill of goods. Now, please, give me that money. <sighs> Either you got a lazy eye or a lack of respect. Which is it, boy? I ain't got no lazy eye. Oh, you no son. respect for the lacks of you. Well, maybe when your mother's finished mourning your father, I'll keep her in black on your behalf. You think on that, boy? Well, maybe you shall, sir. And maybe other events will transpire. What the hell's you that supposed to mean? stick to them books, because mark my words on this. Vengeance is an idiot's game. Ah, Mrs. Downs, thank you for your punctuality. It's next to godliness, isn't it? That's cleanliness. Oh, you yeah. have to take your word on that. Oh, this kid's gonna try something. Good day. That kid's gonna come for us eventually. I know it. so we don't have to go all the way back to camp. <clears throat> It'll do it for us. All right, let's see what we got for the camp and what our take was on this whole thing. Oh, boy. That is insane. All right, let's check the map. Big Valley, west side. Oh, look. Big Valley West Side. Dakota River. In the Big Valley. So the crown above the head means that we got it, you're saying, right? Oh no, you're saying that just means that it's legendary. If you killed the buck, it'll have a crown on it. 
and it'll be scratched out. Okay, so it's not scratched out, so that means I must have not gotten this one. But good to know. Because there are some times I'll just boot this game up and I'll just I'll just hunt things. It's so much fun. But that's what you're talking about. Rice Granby, this guy right here. Is Sheriff Morgan? <laughs> I want to. Oh, so let's go look at. Um, let's look at what I've made. Maybe I thought that they were legendary. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe they were just like regular animals. I happen to get like good skins on. Pearson, get your butt over here. Hey, all right. Let's go get some stew, I guess. Hi, right, sir. Me and Lenny brought some guns in. Robbed them off that gang that runs around here. Good work, Arthur. I Actually, you let's get some coffee. Sell them. Get that dead eye up, yo. Alright, so another thing I found out too with the ledger. Oh, Arthur, I left something for you by your tent. Oh, thanks. Oh, thank you for that seasoning you brought me. Oh, thank you. Okay, thank you. Alright, so we'll just we'll restock the ammo. Alright, so. I've got everything else done. There's no reason for the camp to have any extra money. Because if I want to restock stuff and the money isn't in the camp, then I could just take it out of my own pocket. So that two grand, I'm probably going to get some good guns with that. So here's the <clears throat> fast travel map once it's upgraded. Oh, I've also run into the KKK a handful of times, and uh, I've had so much fun killing them. I remember the first time I ran across them, which is actually close to this camp. Nice night, ain't it? Wait. And uh, I threw a throw of Molotov cocktails or those fire bottles at them. Another time I ran across them, they were setting up during the day, and uh, their cross fell on them, and uh, I still killed them. <laughs> I still took a shotgun, I blew their heads off. All right, I've never once used these throwing knives, so these I don't need those yet. All right. What did you leave by my tent? Did you leave me some pomade? Sweet. Okay. Let's get some sleep. And then uh, we'll go do that side mission. We got to loot that house to get that dude's like old possessions. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you followed. Thank you for the host. I appreciate it, my friend. I was misspoken. Okay. Um, Good morning, Arthur. Good morning, Dutch. We'll get some coffee and then we'll roll out.
when I was first hunting, I didn't really, like, understand how to, like, properly get good pelts. Until I realized that I had to, like, actually hog tie them. And then approach them after they're hog tie or, um, like, lasso them. And then approach them, uh... Oh, I was gonna show you what I have here. And actually knife them in the throat. And sometimes even then you don't get good pelts. Pearson. Stop trying to feed everybody. This camp could do with a few improvements. Alright, so I got the two perfect goat hides. I'm sorry, no I don't. I have the elk uh, antlers. And the hanging bones. Nothing there. The pronghorn skull. And the pronghorn leather table tops. I think that's all I think that's all that I have. Yeah, I know about that. Yeah. That's all I have. Thank you, Mr. Pearson. My table awaits your offerings, Mr. Morgan. Ah well. All right. Actually, let's figure out because we got a bounty on our heads. So we'll do this. That's not a bad bounty. That's not a bad bounty. 120 bucks, and then we'll like we'll roll over to the post office here, and we'll and we'll pay off our uh, we'll pay off our bounty. I also want to look at my guns this way. Yeah, that's my girl. <laughs> it's so crazy that I never even found out about the cinematic camera until like two or three streams in. It's like so great, like especially like when I'm just chilling on the couch or whatever. Like, it gives me an opportunity to text everybody that I missed while I was playing the game. <laughs> or it's good, too, because, like, you'll just be riding and then you hear someone scream for help or you hear a gunshot, so you can, like, quickly jump out of the cinematic camera and, like, check to see what's going on. Same fine weather, ain't it? is good. Morning. Gunshots around here. Are they robbing a train? This is what I was talking about. Now we get to loot all these guys. I don't know who's good and who's bad. That looks like the train conductor up there. Oh man, look at that hole right in his face.
and then we'll check the train. Maybe some will be left over. Oh, that was a that was a good guy. Look, there's a dude standing right there. They're gonna think I looted the train. Take whatever you can carry, my friend. Canned vegetables? Take them. <clears throat> no. Oh, well, I didn't want to... You're fine, Arthur. Everything's already pretty much looted. It looks like, oh, there's a loot box right here. Ah, oh, shoot, come on. Yeah, this thing is, uh, this thing already got, this thing already got robbed. There's nothing left. Here's the caboose, or not the caboose, the engine. So I could actually drive this if I wanted. My trusty steed was following me. Uh, I don't think I looted this guy. What I'm going to do is I'm going to check that uh, that wagon. This is a good guy, but it's okay. I'm still a good guy. I just, I just robbed from people. I mean, they're dead. Come on now. Nothing good back there, but we will take this. To the fence. We gotta go there. The fence is up here. So we'll go to the fence, we'll pay off our bounty, and then we'll go back down here. Sounds like a plan. Yep. I like it when a plan comes together. Not bad. Look at that. My screen time was down 28% on my phone. I like getting that update. Nobody knows the difference. They looted the train, I killed them, and then looted them. Oh, I still have the mask on. Take that off. Okay, good. And yeah, people start questioning what you're doing when you're wearing the mask. Oh, gosh. Oh! Let's slow down a little bit. I don't want to wheel the bump off this thing. It's really nice too, like uh, riding around and like seeing all the wildlife just doing its own thing. Oh, uh, Code Mars, you gotta send me your uh, your gamer tag when you have time. Get out of the way, Turkey! Ah, he did. He's not gonna make it into Red Dead Redemption Three.
Come on, guys. Will you move? Oh, shit. You want your hide hung? What's the issue? Ah, can't be bothered. Oh, shit. You shit ah. bastard. I didn't mean to. Shot him in the fingers. Oh, come on, really? God, this guy's gonna be a witness. Come on, I just wanted to. I just wanted to pay off my bounty from the last bad thing that I did, guys. Stop making me do bad things. I'm a good guy at heart. I bring herbs and stuff. I pick flowers. I'm not a bad guy. I promise. The environment makes me do bad things. It's not my fault. You stop blaming me for things. No. Hold on, I don't want to shoot him. I've been on the run for days now. Uh, if you could help me with these shackles, I, I just might have a chance. I'll only help you. <clears throat> just shoot the chains off, please. I'm done for otherwise. All right, stop moving. Oh, oh, yes. Yes. Perfect. Ah, thank you. Mm -hmm. I, I got no money to give you, but I think I might got something even better. He's going to rob me. Well, some... Tr hey, what the hell? Get away from me. Sorry. I don't want whatever you're selling. Let's go. I had a sneaky feeling. He's like, I got something even better. I got your wagon now. <laughs> I helped you with your shackles. Now leave me alone. Now hopefully I get a pretty penny for this wagon. That'd be nice. What is going on? Why did you run into... Directly into the sign? What are you guys doing? Are these horses drunk? Why would you run directly into a sign? Put this gun away. And that wasn't even my vol... Yeah, that was my volcanic pistol. Mama's a word. Nobody knows nothing. Figured this might be of interest to you. Is there a war on I don't know about? How the hell you get it so beat up? And this is for you. Oh, I didn't even think about that. So long. Forty bucks. Hey, puppers. So I didn't even think about that. Like, if you return... Uh, if 
you return something like a wagon to them like the quality matters also what is this place oh, it's just a house I beat that guy up Morning. once Welcome. How do you do? How can one crook raise so much hell? Don't call me a crook. That's offensive to my gang care now. of crooks. Jeez, slow down, buddy. Come on now. All right, now we'll go to this person's place. Now the bounty's paid. Everything's good. That's a stable. We want to go here. You know what's really fun to play in this game is like dominoes and poker, but I feel like um, it's not really lucrative to play them. You can play for money and it's like fun to play for money, but I feel like if you're like, I want to make some money, let's play some poker, let's play some dominoes. Poker's much faster than dominoes at um, making money, but maybe I haven't come to a town yet where like the stakes are high enough or the money is um, yeah. worth it. Ooh, that rabbit was lucky. Morning. <clears throat> Whoa. So one time I was bringing a bounty back. Uh, scythe mission? No spoilery, but I was bringing a, I was bringing a bounty back, and uh, these other bounty hunters tried to kill me to get the bounty. Like they wanted to take the bounty from me, and they were willing to kill me over it. Oh, you know what I want to do? I want to, I want to look at my guns. Here we go. So this is the gun. This is the volcanic pistol that I have. I'm going to clean it now, though. It's a little dirty. Clean that bad boy up. So this is the uh, volcanic pistol. I got some etchings on it. That's what it looks like aimed. Looks pretty good. Try nothing. You best move on. <laughs> what if I just fired at it like this? What? Um, and then other than that, I think this one is the other one I was souping up. Yeah, so we'll clean this one. I got a scope on it because I was using this often. Um, but I kind of started using the volcanic pistol once I got it. So this one isn't like fully done yet, which I'll probably do soon. Uh, so I got like the wood grain on it. What? What? Oh, I must have accidentally dropped it and not put it back on. Because it's comfortable. Uh, the dogs went yep. bathroom both times. Uh, typical. But yeah, so those are the those are the guns that I um, kind of like souped up, so they're not naturally like that. I'm not following you, you weird stranger. I'm going my way, and you're going your way. We just happen to be going the way the same direction. Yeah, like somewhere. I don't know if it's in this forest, but like somewhere next to like a red barn is where the KKK guys always meet up. Alright. 
Come in. Adjust fists. Oh wait, we want... Oh, we double handing this? What is going on? There we go. Watch, pistol, and ledger. By order of Judge Meredith Holden in the courts of the state of Lemoyne, we do hereby grant repossession of this property and all items here into the Bank of Roads. M. Holden, Judge Holden, Henrietta Blackley Clerk, November 18th, 1895. Okay. Watch pistol. Empty. What I want to look at it for. Ledger watch pistol. June 7th, 1855. Dear sir, please accept this likeness of your family as a small token of appreciation for your assistance in the recovery of my property. Like your old pa, you're a cunning old dog and a credit to this community. <laughs> Yours, Colonel Joshua Nixon, the Ascension Plantation. April 2nd, 1870. Dear Mr. Thompson, I'm afraid there's no more work for you down here at the plantation. I'm grateful for the help you've given us and the help your pappy and your pappy's pappy gave us before you. These are trying times for all of us. You are in our thoughts and prayers. Yours truly, Colonel J. Nixon, the Ascension Plantation. Watch. That's the old watch. Now the ledger and the pistol. And he starts smoking more cigarettes. This might be the ledger too, right under it. Dear Jeremiah, there ain't nothing here any value. I wouldn't give you a nickel for it. Come by for a sup of whiskey any time. Bill. Yes. I was sorry to hear of Betsy's passing. Things is easier up there for sure. No, not the ledger. Okay. Okay. Where is all this old crap? Nope. Okay. I like how we're getting like story in here though. Dear Mr. Thompson, after numerous complaints from customers and fellow employees alike, we must terminate your employment. There's just no place for a man like you at the Central Union Railroad Company. Why is it glowing yet? I can't do nothing about it. Oh, here we go. Uh, trap door, huh? Interesting. <laughs> huh? What you doing here? 
We found this place first. Yeah. Easy. I'm just looking around for some things. Hmm. That old revolver yours? <laughs> Finders keepers. Ah! Son of a bitch! Well. Oh, God damn it. damn it! Come on, man! Where are you going? Come on! Son of a bitch! Ugh. Now you made my hand all bloody. Thanks a lot, guys. Nothing. Jokers. He's laying right on the trap door, too. Loot him. Here's the pistol. Man, you made my outfit all bloody. Look at this. Can't believe it. Oh, that'll be the pistol. Just the ledger now. You just hang out right there. Oh wait, here's a latch. I still want to double check the upstairs, even though they say there's nothing of value, I should always double check. Look at the floating hat and knife. Look at that hat. Look at that hat and knife. Oh, they, they fell. And it is dark in here. Is there any zombies? Okay, so we're looking for a ledger now. Yeah. Oh, there's the ledger. Let's open it. This your ledger? A list of slaves? Uh. Rewards. January 15th, Betsy. $17. January 18th, Louise. $12. May 18th, Wilfred, $18. May 24th, Minnie and Child, $20. So basically, hold on, we'll get more here. Well, that's that. I was somewhere near Rhodes when they caught me. Till the day I die, I ain't gonna forget the sound of that dog barking in my heels. But I don't suppose that day gonna be far off yet. It was 50 lashings yesterday and 50 more to come. I don't think I can take any more. Man said he was doing his job. Funny kind of employment if you ask me, but I suppose you ain't. Lights fading, so that's it for now. I do hope I live to see the end of this war and justice win out. <laughs> June 64. God. So, if, if I'm not mistaken, this dude was... Oh, look, these are the slave chains. So this guy wasn't good at all. He posed himself as like this this weak old man who just wanted a few of his things back that like lost uh, his home. But in reality, he was a bad, bad man. All right, we'll go out the back. I think I don't think there's going to be anything upstairs. Man, there could be. Oh, never mind. The stairs are broken. Now I definitely have to go have a bath. I'm not going to catch up to these guys. Come here. Good. Come here, piggy pig. It's a boar. Man, 
I got blood all over my jacket. That was a three star, by the way. Oh, I didn't mean to skid it. <clears throat> I guess I have to. It doesn't go on the back. Perfect boar pelt. I should try to find that other one. Shoot, he's right there. I said unknown animal. I just killed a boar, so wouldn't it tell me? All right, that's a three star too. Great, not bad. Yep. Fork tenderloin, baby. What's this? Oh, we gotta go back to that guy. Let's go, girl. Yeah. I don't want to run too fast in here. I have a tendency to uh, be magnetic towards trees. some respect I was respected once I had a profession you asked me to get you something there's no bringing back what I want I want my job my pride the respect accorded to a gentleman what about this old crap huh I think don't you understand those bastards have changed everything I was a good worker I took pride in my work they, they, they took it away. Pissed on my legacy. Oh, man. Some jobs ain't for saving. And some legacies? Oh, do you... They are for Ooh, pissing What off. are you doing? That's, that's my history. <laughs> ah, God. Damn you. Damn you. I still exist. He won't in a second if it gives me an option. <laughs> hmm, how do we want to do this? <laughs> Is 
Is it not letting me kill him? There we go. It's not letting me kill him. See, like, there's the dot, right? If I aim my weapon, it disappears. There we go. Put him out of his misery. No one will complain. Alright, so I want to go back to... Uh, back to my camp. Let's go back here. It's making scary you murdered somebody and somebody caught you music. But nobody saw. Yeah. I didn't hit him because he was an old drunk. <clears throat> I thought his head was going to blow off his body, though, so I'm a little upset about that. Yes, they did. Now I got what's coming to me. back home. Oh, another crazy thing that happened to me when I wasn't streaming. Um, I was in like the swampy area that's more towards the east. And uh, I saw somebody hanging from a tree. They were already dead. But I felt bad, so I decided that I was going to cut them down. Um, so I, I passed them because I was in the cinematic camera. There, girl. And uh, so I stopped the camera. I turned around to come back. I started aiming my gun to shoot at the rope. And uh, these three dudes came out with, like, dried mud on their face. But they looked like zombies right away. They would attacked me. They didn't have any guns. They were just running at me with, like, their arms out. Um, it freaked me out, and I shot them. And then I eventually cut the dude down and then looted him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it was, it was interesting. You know, one thing I need to do is I need to go into town. I need to sell all of my, uh, the items that I've been keeping. Normally, I would give them to the camp, but... Since we pretty much already bought everything that we needed to in the camp, I don't feel the need to dump money into the camp anymore. And if there's something that I need to buy, like resupplies of something, I'll just, uh, it, I, it'll directly pull out of my own pocket if the camp doesn't have enough money. So there's no reason for me to put my own money into the camp anymore like I was doing pretty much the whole game at this point. clean and 
good girl. Okay. Now let's drop off these boar pelts. To Pearson. We'll go get some stew. We're stuck in the ship now, Mr. Morgan. Calm in down, Swanson. Drowning in mud. You're leave me alone, you crazy you drunk. Quite away with words. Words are the very least of my problems. The very least. Not where did sure. where did his plate go? He had a plate and it just disappeared. We are gonna overcome these challenges. Now, bring me something soon if you can, Arthur. All right, Pierce. Can't wait to taste this. How are you doing? Good job, Mr. Morgan. About as good. I've come up with some ideas for ways to improve goes. things around here. If you want to. Oh, I need look. four perfect boar pelts. So two more, and then I can get. Uh, John's camp a little bit better. I reckon I need to get my hands on some materials first. You know what sound is like super accurate? Is the sound when he's like eating out of the bowl. It annoys me. But just listen, it's so accurate. It's like that wood on wood sound. Okay. So we are good. Get a little sleep. We'll go into the next main town. I forget what it is. Um, we'll go into the main town. I'll sell a bunch of my stuff off. I'll look at the guns and everything, and then we'll do the next main mission, because I think there's no more side missions. Okay. There was a weight on my heart, so I wonder what that means. We'll go here. We'll eventually do this. Go to the general store. You don't. Don't make a convincing law, man. We're gonna get some coffee first. We're almost a good boy. We do naughty things sometimes, so we're still a good boy. shot oh you know what I also should do well let me do it here I'm trying to craft stuff, but I guess it's not letting me do it there. Maybe I don't have anything to craft. Okay then, girl. I think this is the red barn I was talking about. So like, I think the KK yeah. guys show up in like this forest over here. I wanna say they show up like in this area. I might be wrong though. 
I know it's like really close to the red barn. Well, that's a crazy walkway for that house. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. No, I don't want to clean it. What are you doing? This guy didn't get killed though. Oh, sorry horse oh my god sorry horse I didn't mean to shoot you horse I'm a prisoner of these men I'll get you and he got one right in the eye Mister, help me. I'll help you I'll help you after I help myself. They got me caught up here. I see. Come on! Let me out of this! Stop crying. I'm sorry, horse. I did not mean to I do that. To like I've unfortunately killed, like, healthy. this is probably my third horse I've killed in the game. What the hell happened? What was that noise? I'll loot the rest of the camp after this. You're free, my friend. You have no idea how thankful I am. You ain't home and dry yet. Run along. I know. I think they hid my things in one of those boxes. Sir, they are yours. All right. Well, guess I'm one of the good guys. This guy is like in the way. <clears throat> No. Looks dumb. Worst reviver. Peach. All right, so it's letting me craft over here. Is this the chest? Nothing in there. Oh, look at that. I didn't even know that could happen. Just pull the loot box out, dude. Doesn't seem really anything else of value here. Cocaine gum. That was it. That was all your things. Hat. That chest. There's nothing else here. Terrible. 
Uh, craft. I certainly need a bath, too. Roll. Come on, Dakota. My baby. Good girl. Okay. Morning, sir. How there, mister? You know, I've asked myself, how close am I to, like, literally putting my mask on and, like, robbing people's houses? Because I rob people at camps. But I'm trying to figure out, like, where my morals are. <laughs> Oops, excuse me. Look out! Alright, so let's see where we can tie our horse. We can tie her at the Undertaker's. It's a goddamn war. What's going on, Joe? Morning, Phil. <laughs> hey! Hey, it's good to see you again, friend. But, uh... What you doing here? Just visiting old friends, I guess. Well, you better get out of here. There's a, there's a bunch of government agents I met. Asking about you all across town. Oh, no. Uh, them and a bunch of bounty hunters, too, I think. Oh, shoot. Uh, so? Yeah. Yeah, but <laughs> you don't seem too scared. Guess not. Well, they seem pretty mad. <laughs> What'd you do? Nothing good. <laughs> well, <laughs> you better get out of here. <laughs> Uh, that's not good. Hey. Fine morning today. Hmm. Long time no see. Yep. Have a look. All for sale. Except the floorboards. Oi. Okay. This should be good. Oh. He's not accepting that stuff. Gin, cheese wedge, chocolate bar. You know one thing that I do get a lot of that I could probably sell? Um, is like the brandy. Uh, this here store is my whole life. That's why I drink. <laughs> That's why I drink. Okay, I'll take it. Okay. Been a pleasure doing business with you. Thanks for your assistance. 
All right, let's go to the gunsmith. See if we can soup up our guns. I'm sure there's a bunch of upgrades Hello? I need to buy. I'm sure if I'd see you again. What can I offer you? Let's have a look. That guy's beard is weird. Oop, wrong thing. Let's go to the, uh... I want to go to the accessories. So let's get the upgraded holster. Hmm. All right, so we got uh, the upgraded gun belt, we got the upgraded holster, and I already had the upgraded uh, bandolier. Bandolier. Sold a few of those to some very discerning customers. Um, I think I need more rifle, 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 shotgun. Okay, why can't I buy this? Item is locked. Let's just buy it all right now. Doesn't cost too much. Can't tell if this is. I make sure to test all my goods for quality and defects. That's a guarantee. All right. All right. Okay. That's locked. This. So let's just customize at this point. Got twenty three hundred bucks to spend. And that should be good. All right. Volcanic pistol. I pretty much have done everything. Well, if that gun ain't shining. Yeah, I've done everything. I, you take care of what's yours. I've done everything I can about that. Um, I use range and accuracy is lower, but the reload is higher. I don't use this often, but the double-barreled shotgun looks like it's better. I'd take range and accuracy over a reload time. Let's soup this bad boy up. Looks like you're taking care of that weapon. Good to see. I can put some sights on that if you're interested. Okay, so let's look at the length. We can add to the length. That'll give us a little bit more accuracy. Let's You'll do it. You'll notice the difference. This will add to the range. Put put some put some iron sights on here, sure. Accuracy, a little bit better. That's a wise investment. Uh, wood grain's fine. This is just You'll merely for looks. Uh, I don't want wrap. Doesn't do anything. Okay, styles, metals. Interested in engraving some? Make that weapon your own. Hmm. See if we can make it like all black. See if we can do engravings. Full engrave. I maybe shouldn't say this, but I sold a derringer to a seamstress. A white one, of course. Inlay metals. Okay, so let's change the inlay metal to... Oh, that looks good. That looks a little muddy. That one too. That one too. Oh, okay, it just took a second to load. I keep away from the butcher's sausage. There's a reason he keeps the price so low. Gross. I think we'll do that one. All right. Carvings.
Eagle. This here stall's as proud and fine as the town it lives in. Oh, yes. Yeah, we already got all the ammunition. Hunting knife. <laughs> so this is my hunting knife. <laughs> I put skulls and chains on it. Metals engraving and varnish. So I changed the handle. What else do I use? Volcanic pistol. Sawed off shotgun. Hunting knife. This one's good. Rolling block rifle. That gun seems to be well taken care of. Weapons only as good as its stock. Got some fine ones cut just for it. Yeah, so I have the I have the long scope on it. I guess it doesn't mess with the the stats, but it just kind of goes for look. I got the eagle on this one also. And I and I bought the wrap, but I actually don't like the wrap. I don't have any engravings. Really <clears throat> shine with some carbon in it. I think that's fine. Bolt action. Well, if that gun ain't shining, glad you take care of what's yours. Interested in a stock? Could put some carbons on it too. We're gonna improve all of these, not more or less for like. Uh, the short one looks better. That'll help, I'm sure. This isn't really messing with uh, stats. That's a wise investment. I don't want the wrap. Don't care about that too in much. Some? Make that weapon your own. Looks like you're taking care of that weapon. Good to see. Weapon's only as good as its stock. Got some fine ones cut just for it. You'll notice the difference. No wrap. That could really shine with some carbon in it. Okay, so I well, clearly messed with this one shine. a little bit. Glad you take care of what's yours. I can rifle the barrel for you if you'd like. That'll help, I'm sure. Yeah, and I think I've messed with this already. I haven't spent that much, only like 300 Looks so like far. You're taking care of that weapon. Good to see. Hey, you know that gun could use a few choice parts. Really make a sing. That's a wise investment. You'll notice the difference. Interested in engraving some? Make that weapon your own. I should be putting the eagle on everything I have. Double action revolver. Okay, clean this one first. You don't keep your gun clean. It's liable to bust on you just when you need it. All right, just chill out. Got some nice parts for that gun, you know. Ooh, look at that. That'll help, I'm sure. That's a wise investment. That looks sick. Okay. Oh, maybe I should do an engraving on this one. Inlay metals. Full engraving. Look 
color doesn't look that good though. You spend much time in the parlor house? Every time I'm there, I thank it, God I'm armed. All right, last one. That gun seems to be well taken care of. I can improve the accuracy of that, you know. Love it. You'll notice the difference. We're going to do everything we can. You'll appreciate the improvement. Money is no question. Let's make this the golden gun. The black trigger. No, we'll keep it clean. All right, so we spent like what? Five hundred total. Like suspicious about the new faces in town. Rhodes is welcoming to be sure, but we can't just let all types have their way. Okay. What time is it? We spent all day here? Jeez, we spent all day in the gun shop. I'm running out, Rhodes! Get him right here! Can I buy your newspaper, boy? Guess not. Why are you barking at this window? Why are you barking, boy? No vacancies. Maybe I can take a bath here, hopefully. Hi, folks. Hello, sir. Why, hello there. Nice people around here. Hard. How's it going? Hmm. Haven't you brought enough misery upon us? What? I done nothing but got in a bar fight that one time. Looks like I can't even go in there to take a bath. Sheriffs. Oh, and then I dug up a dead body in the in the in the graveyard behind the church. So what? I didn't do anything bad. Can I just take a bath? Hey y'all. How do you do? I just want to take a bath. What's in this barn? What's in this little shack? What's in here? Oh, a toilet. Well, let's do the main story. Out of the damn way, oh. partner. partner. <laughs> Out of the damn way, partner. He's my best friend. He left me. I lost him. I mean, I lost him. Someone must have seen an Englishman. <laughs> really funny he is. <laughs> Mister. Uh, listen, have you seen... I'm looking for my friend, Gavin. I don't know any Gavins, I'm afraid. English bloke. Lovely fella. He went missing, and uh, now I'm all alone. Good luck. <laughs> That's, uh, that's too bad. Gavin! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that was something. Didn't even trigger like a, hey, by the way, if you find Gavin. Probably should have got my horse. I thought this was much closer. It's alright. Arthur needs to exercise sometimes. Oh my goodness, we're going to this fancy plantation house. Hey, move! He's doing his job, Arthur. Excuse me, partner. 
Hey. Run through the corn, running through the corn. Sheriff's orders. You wanted me to have a word with some folk on the property. I'm recently deputized, you see. Deputized? And I suppose Lee was drunk when he did it? Look, you can come in, but you ain't talking with me. Obliged. Find out more about the Greys. So they're just essentially going to ask around. I was hoping you'd talk a moment. I'm a student of the history of the region, and... Uh, I ain't the one to speak to. Try Master Bo. Think he's down there by the wood store. Boy's got all the time in the world. Okay, speak to Bo over here. Nope. Oh. <laughs> I thought I could hop the, the bush. see you at the sheriff's office excuse me friend we friends not yet but he is hoping I guess we don't get a lot of traveling men here and suddenly there's a whole phalanx of mysterious but strangely helpful Yankees about the place is there what are you doing here I was just looking for work well, looking for something don't worry, your secret's safe with me. What secret? I got a secret of my own. Are you secretly normal? Excuse me? Never mind. The thing is, I don't care if you kill the whole lot of us and the Braithwaites. I don't want to kill anyone. I love her, you know. Love who? Penelope. But it's impossible. Well, love tends to be complicated. She's a Braithwaite. I'm Bo Gray, son of Tavish Gray. Oh, no. Nephew of Lee Romeo Gray, and Juliet. Sheriff, grandson of old Murdo Gray. We Greys have been loyal to the state and murderers to the Braithwaites for so long now, no one can even quite explain why. Beyond blind loyalty and stupidity, I'm supposed to be loyal to some nonsense while she... She's amazing. She's like a woman from the future. She's like tomorrow, if tomorrow turns out fine. Well, I'm sorry for your predicament. Would you help? I don't want to get involved in <laughs> gang feuds. Seems unseemly. I'll pay. I've got money. How much? We graze. We've always got money. No brains, mine, but money. Well, in that case... I know she loves to sit out in the gazebo on the edge of the Braithwaite property. Take her this letter and this bracelet. Please. Okay. Well, was that the dude I was looking for, though? Look out for their guards. They're worse with strangers than ours are. I guess so. Man, I gotta go all the way over here. This better not be like one long like back and forth. So long and good luck. See if my horse will come in here. Oh she did. Please don't hit that here. tree. Okay, girl. Uh wait, what is it? Tying me to? Oh, same thing. Okay. Oh, sneak into the grounds. Oh, wonderful.
boy. So we gotta be sneaky, boys. <clears throat> Delivering a letter to Juliet. Oh, I was like, please don't run into it. Please don't run into it. Obviously, yeah. And you're acting as a deputy for Sheriff Gray. That's my girl. How far am I? Why is he making me go this way? Go this way. Oh. There we go. I got whatever that was. Horseman 2. I don't know what it was, but I did it. Horseman 3 unlocked. Ride to, from Valentine to Rhodes in less than five minutes. Oh, boy. That's that's cool. So that means, like, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I'll go this way, I guess. I don't know if that means, like, on my own. Does that mean my horse is faster? Or is that, like, fast travel? Or that's, like, stagecoach? the way it naturally wants me to go is like an opposite way for me to go on my GPS. What are those? Cows? I haven't killed one of those yet. You're more likely to be spotted on horseback. This might move quietly to avoid attention. Do not attack guards. Oh, fart. Okay, so there are the guards. We need to, oh, come on. I gotta go all the way over here. So it's best if I kind of go around. More towards the right. Because we got like three guards in front here. There's a guard over there, too. How many gazebos they need? I ask myself that question to everybody every day. Let's go down the shoreline, maybe. There's a guard over there, though. Penelope Braithwaite. Why, yes, I am. I've got a letter for you. Oh. And. Oh. A gift. <laughs> a letter and a gift. Well, we don't even know each other. <laughs> well, mm -hmm. it's not from me. It's from. Uh... From Bo. <gasps> oh, he is so. Strange. 
Yes, he's a little strange, but also so human. The rest of our families are stuck in the Dark Ages, or, well, I don't know, cave people, perhaps. Bo's different, but if they find out, they'll kill him and send me to live someplace awful, like Ohio. <laughs> have you ever been to Ohio, sir? No. Well, neither have I, but my uncle has a factory there. He was sort of the black sheep on account of having left. But now they tolerate him because he's a vicious snob. Families are... Yeah, tell are, us more about your family. something else. Hmm. You got a family, sir? No. She's really. a talkative type. Well, they tolerate him because of the money. But me, with my ideas above my station, they can't stand. That sounds pretty complicated. I, I don't know quite what to say. Well, nothing to say except I hope they all rot. I don't, uh, well, maybe a bit, but here, if you see Bo again, will oh. you give this to him? Sure. I'm not a sneak the heck out of here. Oh my god, leave the area without being seen. Wonderful. Can I take this boat? Can I, like, legit just take this boat? Oh, boy. Might as well just go back this way, down the coastline. Just turn around. Just go this way. Swim across the water. Oh god, this is draining my energy fast. How do I get to that shoreline? This looks familiar, actually. Let's see where we gotta go back. This is like the edge. We gotta go here. We're not going back that way though. Wrong, buddy. Sorry. All right, let's be careful. Let's get back on the road. It's getting dark out. Wait, stop. Yeah. I need two more of these to be able to do John Morrison's thing if I can get them perfect pelts. Shoot! Get over here! He was only a two star though, but I'll, I'll deal with it. Okay. That's it. Don't 
Darn. I need it to be three stars. I'll try to find the other one, too. Good. It's not perfect. Let's go back a ways. See if the scent, the scent is still around. Might have lost its trail. Rabbits. Don't care about those too much. Okay, good. Perfect white tailed deer. Not bad. Not bad, huh, girl? Yeah, not too bad. Of course, she had to get the boars that I wanted, though. I'm a little worried though. Hopefully this deer is going to survive. up here. Jesus Christ. I don't know what you did to deserve this. I can't... A hillside? Killer clue piece one. Hard to see at the dark. You know, I saw another one of those um, under the train tracks. Uh, collect the matching torn map pieces to uncover the mystery. 
This looks like the dude got picked up from the road because the tracks stopped there. Come on, baby. Yep. Easy. Whoa. The, yeah, so there's another body like that hanging from the train tracks. I ran past it one time. I don't know if it was in a stream or not. But I ran past not knowing what it was. I was like, oh yeah, that's gross, but I didn't think anything of it. these people are. Taking too long to shoot. No, stop it. was uh, bad for a second. I wanted to be sneaky and throw knives, but they found me. I think I need to go to a fence to uh, to sell all like, my pocket watches and stuff. I was like trying not to make noise. They were all in one big area. I could have thrown like a... Uh, Him. Maybe I already robbed this guy. Maybe I didn't rob this guy? No, it looks like I got everyone. Uh, I wanted to throw a Molotov cocktail, but I was trying to, like, be quiet. Didn't work that way, though. Medical box. What do we got in here? Nothing I don't already have. Oh, there's a crate I can loot. That is in here. Hey. I guess I can do this. This will help identify. Okay, so there's a... Something under here. <clears throat> Did the fire get put out? I think there's a like a loot box under here. There we go. 
Get that loot box. Cocaine gum. That's it. Terrible. Why do I kill you fools and I don't get nothing for it? Oh, there's a chest over there. And there's something here too. A fine brandy. Anything good? Lame. All right, where was I going again? I gotta go back this way. I do need to get this up. Come on, Dakota, you gotta catch up with me. Oh, it looks scary with all the dust. Alright. Yep. You moron! What? You better watch your language before you lose your hat and your head. By my shotgun. Alright, so I'm here in the town, but I don't think any of the shops are going to be open for me to bring over this deer. Vote you don't tell them, but I just witnessed it. Remember me? I'm working for the Grays now. All right, come on. Actually, if I go over here. You got my money? Sure. Better have a lot of it. Did she give anything? That's it? For me? Yes. Might I have it? Sure. But it'll cost you. Ah, <laughs> uh, I can't be bothered. Here, take it. Oh, thank you, Arthur. You'll... Thank you. My God. What a woman. She's pregnant by my last letter. She's... This'll get her killed, for sure. What? Women's suffrage. Around here, they don't even like men voting. They'd bring back the monarchy, given half the chance. Progress is a dirty word in these parts. Unlike incest. Excuse me? I don't want to marry my cousin Matilda. I want to marry Penelope. Ugh. But they're gonna... They'll kill her at one of those rallies they're holding. They've done it before. Mr. You gotta help. No, I'm afraid I don't want no part of it. I'll pay. My family, we've still got some money. Fine. Just no more running around with letters. Thank you. Come on. We better get going. Oh, boy. Thought I was going to be done. Mount up, all right. And follow me to Rhodes. Come on! Come on! Yeah. We'll go around the property and take the road to town. 
Well, I don't know what's going to happen with this, uh, this buck that I have here. Probably should skin it. Easy boy. Evening? Calm down. I can't be calm. If we don't get there in time, my true love may be shot. Hold on. The day is changing rapidly right now. From like 5 a.m. to whatever this time is now. to keep it intact, but it's going to start rotting. What were you saying again? If she wants to rally, you got to let her rally. Well, good as the cause is, I can't let her become a martyr to it. I, I want to marry a flesh and blood woman. Not a statue in her honor. I'm sure they know what they're doing. There! There they are! Bo, what are you doing here? I cannot let you go through with this! You'll be killed! I'm prepared to die for the cause, Bo. You know that. Do something, please! What the hell am I supposed to do? Fight this mob. They leave me alive. This is no way to sir. They need protecting from certain elements. Mostly my family. Penelope, I beg you. I'll tell you what. Your friend here can drive the wagon for us. It'll allow us to shout all the louder. Hooray! Oh. Miss Calhoun. Miss Calhoun. My friend here says he can drive the wagon. Well, Olive Calhoun. Normally, I like to drive myself, but today I feel like a man joining us sends the right message. Well, I ain't never been in a protest march before, madam. Well, just treat us like the sheep and the folks attacking us like the wolves, and I'm sure you'll feel right at home. Shall we go? <clears throat> All right, ladies. I need a shave. We know our song is a good one, mm -hmm. and we know our calls is a pure one yes ma'am let liberty reign oh boy we're mothers wives housekeepers and daughters we cook the food and we fetch the now water. now take us down main street right through town to the steps of the bank of roads mr what was your name Arthur Morgan. very good mr morgan not too quick and not too slow we need them to hear our voice. Well, they'll hear it all right. Very good, very good. Mr. Morgan, are you an old friend of the movement? Boy, everyone's coming out. Driver, Mrs. Calhoun. Maybe a shotgun messenger if it comes to it. I hope it won't. Well, our message will be delivered peaceably, Mr. Morgan. You can keep your shotgun to yourself. Stay on Main Street. Uh, it's a left up here, Mr. Morgan. Look at these people. It's about to get exciting. I Watch, lady. You're about to get run over by my wagon. Good day, Sheriff. I trust you'll make sure it's a peaceful assembly. Oh boy, are they gonna start throwing tomatoes? The species. Yeah, that's a pretty dumb specimen, I grant it. Almost there. Take us just a little further, please. This spot is fine, sir. Ladies! Get down! Come on! 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 All this trouble of people singing songs. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is a great 
day for all of us. Yay. For today is the day we begin to live as equals. Equals! Ah. Yes, equal, sir. Fair <laughs> that and one equal. Guy. This is unnatural. This is nonsense. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Fair, equal, and free, just as the founding fathers intended. Yeah. Look at that beefy fathers. fellow. Oh. Not founding mothers, you hey, silly you old goat. <laughs> His philosophy hey. dependent on biology. What the hell are you doing here, boy? Keep your voice down. I'm trying to listen to the speech. Hello, darling cousin. Don't you ever speak to me like oh, that. Oh, look at that fat what are you sausage doing here? finger. Listening, I suppose. Go help Bo. His cousin is a moron. And stop them from ruining the speech. All right, let's see if we can do this peacefully. Learn yourself some manners, cousin. Haven't you got anything I got my sheriff, to do? Uh, you always our deputy. Why don't we just leave him? Who the hell is this? Stop him with your fat me. finger. Uh, what? You'll hit me? Oh, come on. Sir, can you not see how idiotic We may have to get into a fist fight here. Come on, Bo. Let's go. Quick now. We gotta go before they think twice. Oh, Lord. Follow me. I know a place. It's an old battlefield no one goes to. Can you hurry up, man? Don't want to go back and hear the speeches? I ain't voted before, but kind of getting hot for voting rights. I don't know whether to take you seriously, Mr. Morgan. My cousins are my primary concern right now. If everyone knows about Penelope and me, everyone knows about Penelope and you. Oh boy. I know about Penelope and you, and I've been here all of 10 minutes. The sooner it's out, the sooner it's resolved. The sooner it's dealt with, you mean. We're dealt with. Our families, the Greys and the Braithwaites, we bury our secrets, and we bury them deep. Your Six feet under. Treasure. You know, Catherine Braithwaite's got a daughter. Oh, oh Jesus Don't Christ, come on. You almost hit that tree. She weren't right. You know, uh, what is with you? Penelope said, uh, I, I ain't heard about daughters. I heard about gold. But Yankee gold? I fear that's just a story, Mr. Morgan. But I don't know. Easy there, girl. I'm really tired. This is awful. Nobody died. Ain't that awful. My cousins are vindictive bastards. My brothers are vindictive bastards. My cousins are worse. They started it. I know, but... You should leave. I will, as soon as I have enough money. When my family, we have money, but I don't. Is your family very rich? Yes, well, I believe so. But uh, they keep me out of the discussions. I have more of a artistic temperament, so. Oh, is that what they call it? Yes. Oh, you made a joke. Mm. I really love her, I do. Well, stick around. Maybe you can die for her as well. I thought you were trying to make me feel better. Look, I gotta go. Me too. Oh, damn! I'm gonna be late. My uncle is quite as bad as you would imagine. Oh, here, your payment. Thank you. Excuse me. Okay. 30 bucks. Is that really worth it? I don't know. But it was main story, so what are you going to do? We just got a buttload of money. The last main story quest. Oh, we're actually seeing the edge here. All right, so let's go back to camp. Abigail. There's main for Abigail. Looks like that's it so far.
This is like the best part of the game. The cinematic camera. You just let it do whatever it's got to do. You have beautiful shots. And then when something happens, you can grab the controller. Like here, for example. Hold on there. A minute of your time. Let's get us a closer look at this. Come on here. Is that no good who took our weapons? There's another guy. Oh shit. Oh no. Ah, I shot the horse on accident. Sorry, horse. You got shot once or twice. Oh, she is dirty. She needs to be brushed. Where's the horse? Did it run off? Oh, that, that glitched out. I wonder if I could take their cart in. Because I have to go to the fence anyway to, like... Can I not search this? No saddlebag. Horse died in vain. Oh, this one died too? Come on. Such a bad guy. Poor horse. I didn't mean to, I swear. Okay, so I looted that guy too, right? These guys, they look like it. Yeah, alright. Alright, let's take this wagon, get some chewing tobacco. Then we'll go to... Uh, this fence doesn't take... It doesn't take... Um, Wagons. This is the, the only wagon fence. So we'll go here and then we'll trade in the rest of our stuff. And then we'll go back to camp. Yep. And then we'll actually get some rest and some coffee and stuff like that. Eat. It looks like I need to eat also. Actually, let's... Let's do this. You didn't see nothing, lady. You didn't see nothing. Oh no, she's investigating. Let's go. Come on, Dakota, let's go. Alright, that's the wrong thing. It's not restoring my core. This is what I need. I always wonder if I have something like this, like a stagecoach that has like an empty basket, or whatever you want to call it. I wonder if I can like hunt a bunch of deer and like throw their carcasses in there and then still have it technically be stored. You know what I mean? Watch out, rabbit. Alright, good. She's swallowing behind me. This one.
You know what I was also trying to... Oh, gross! That was a corpse, like a dead horse in the in the ground or something. Um, I've also tried to, like, catch horses, like wild horses, and sell them. That wasn't really lucrative for the effort. Um, if you, like, go to somebody's camp and you rob them and kill them and you try to take their horse and sell it, they'll, they won't give you a lot of money for it, at least not that I've had. Because they're, like, saying, oh, you don't have papers. Six dollars. I'm like, oh. it's not worth, like, this time spent, like, trekking all the way over there. But the station wagons are kind of okay. Excuse me, wild horse. Am I there yet? No. It's coming up, though. Is she behind me? Where are you? She's far back. Nobody knows. Don't get in the way, puppy, please. I accidentally trampled a dog once when I was walking into a stable because it was like running alongside my horse. In Valentine? This might be of to you. <clears throat> well, ain't this a lovely little thing? Good. Deal. Last time the other one was beat up, I got 30 Pleasure. bucks for it. Let's see what we got here. Again, 40. Alright, but he needs to go over here because I need to sell stuff to him. Been a while since you were through here. All right, take a look. It's worth buying. I'll buy it. Uh, sell Very the whole lot. Nice. Shame 20 to part bucks, with it, I bet. 15 bucks, 5 bucks, oh, 6 bucks. Yeah. People lose these all the time. Yes, they do. Pocket watch. Look at all these pocket watches. 50 bucks. Pick this up off the street. 60? No 32? What do we got here? Bone, snake oil, moonshine, Kentucky bourbon. You can toss okay. that. Real good doing business with you. Buy tomahawks, cleaver, hatchet, machete, lock breaker. Used to silently break locks. Good choice. Sure. Masks. Executioner hood, canvas sack hood, metal skull mask, psycho mask? Yep. Documents. Poison arrow pamphlet. Horse meat pamphlet. Oh, because I already have those. Nice. Special bitters pamphlet. These are essentially recipes. I'm going to buy every one of them. Volatile dynamite pamphlet. I have enough money. Good choice. What was this? Baked beans. Moonshine. Okay. I trust nobody's missing this. Okay. Oh my god, my it's face. Just between us now, <laughs> won't you? Oh boy, that scared me. I was wondering where the heck my hat went. 
gosh. Horse cargo. Good boar, boar pelt. Perfect deer pelt. Where's my outfits, though? I don't want to wear this mask. <laughs> it's scary. Ingredients, materials, kit, valuables, documents, horse cargo. Oh, I think I have to do... This one. Summer Gunslinger, Winter, The Gambler. There we go. That scared me for a second. I did not want to walk around with that, that meat mask on. All right, so we sold our stuff, which is great. We need to get back to camp because we really need to sleep because we haven't slept in a day now. Probably even two at this point. One of the missions cut the time and messed with it enough to give me a beard, so. Can you go back? Hopefully you don't run into anything crazy. Go back to camp. Get some shut eye. Clean ourselves up a bit. And then I think I want to uh I think I'll fast travel. I'll show you guys fast travel. We'll go to uh Valentine. Hopefully there's no issues over in Valentine. We'll go over there. Um, we'll get a bath. We'll probably play some uh, probably pay, play some poker. These are O'Driscoll's, so I won't mind killing them. Last long, did it? Oh my god, is the fire spreading? Oh my god, the fire is spreading. Oh my gosh, the fire is spreading. What have I done? Let's loot these guys quick. That whole cart is burned. Should be like a loot box around here. Oh my god, that pool is like filled with blood now. What happened? I don't want to sleep in the tent. Anything else here? Hat, hat. Dang old Driscolls. Did I loot both these guys? Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, rest by the campfire. I didn't know that. I didn't know the fire would spread. Wow. Okay, so it just went out. That's good to know that like, oh look, you can see like the scorch. Worn Cattleman revolver. 
Alright, let's get out of here because this is probably causing a lot of smoke. There's another smoke over there. Get that rabbit. Oh, your lucky day, hare. My horse needs a good brushing, too. I was over in this town once, and they were not friendly. I don't know. I didn't do anything. Was it this one? No, this is just like a house. Okay, then. Nope. Let me go up this ladder. This is really nothing important. I like how you can still use the... Uh... Oh yeah, what is this? Yeah, hey, that's a dead horse. I think. Still have that mask on? Let's take that off. Slow down, guy. Looks like I'm close to camp. Feels like forever since the last time I came to camp. I wish they would let me, like, put my horse... I wish they would let me put my horse next to my, uh, my little tent. Okay, donate all that. Donate for funds. Donate for provi I should be paying attention. Provisions. Funds, crafting. So I'm gonna keep that and I'll sell that. Okay. 
So let's uh, eat. Because we. Oh, we, they won't let us, will it? Oh, yeah, we were gone for an extra day. You boys are my family now. Abigail has a mission for hey, us. Arthur. What's going on? Jose and John are looking for you. They went out to the moonshine stash, said you knew where that was. They was planning a visit to the breakaway place, but Don needs to do something for Dutch now, so Hosea wants you to join him instead. <sighs> Seems to be a lot going on. You're telling me. Oh, I need to brush my horse. Okay, thank you. Hello, Arthur. Hey, Tilly. Hey, Tilly. She's my favorite. I've lost my mind, Mr. Morgan. Lost it entirely. Nice to see you too, Reverend. I've lost it. I used to be an intellectual. Now I'm just a fool. I'm trying well, to get away from him. I've always been happy as a fool. <laughs> you all just laugh at me. I know you do. Mr. Williamson. Uh, okay. <laughs> Psycho. All right, so um, we need a brush, and she needs to eat too. She's filthy dirty. Look at all that dust. There we go. Good girl. All right. Why does it still say I need a brusher? All made my hair. Gotta look nice. I need a bath so bad. All right. Hello, Arthur. Nothing else. All right. So let's fast travel. <coughs> Actually, you know what? There's a there's a place that's really really cute in Strawberry. So we'll fast travel to Strawberry, and we'll go take a bath, and we'll stay at their lodge. We'll get some rest that way, and then we'll try to we'll try to sell this pelt. There's uh, there's no real reason for me to be dumping money into the camp anymore, just because it's. I bought everything. So I need to pay a little bit more attention when I'm sending things to Pearson because he's doing some for provisions, some for funds, and then some for crafting. So I gotta, I gotta pay a little bit more attention to that. Welcome to Strawberry. What a beautiful shot. All right. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Slow down, slow down. That dude just disappeared and reappeared out of existence. He just teleported. Did you see that? What are you doing? Uh, you know, no. five of them temperance ladies ended up working above the saloon this year. Can you tell me something, baby? He's here early. Salted venison. Lion's paw. 
That's the only thing I can buy, I can sell to him. He won't take the pelts. Maybe the general store will take a pelt. Thanks, Mister. Hello. Out of the damn way. Sorry. There's a familiar face. Hello. Well then, have a look. Well, let's see. Well, I guess maybe I don't know who takes the pelts. So I hear the bank got cleaned out over in Valentine. Shh, be quiet. Don't talk about that. Good to have you. I need a bath. That's okay. Can you organize? All right. Head on over when you're ready. Oh, that's good. I noticed that they actually put markers on the on the map. I don't think they had that before. Uh, by the way, I loot this place every time I show up. This is not my room. But I'll see if anything good is here. No. Whatever's in here, I already have it all. This chest this has something. No. Nope. And then uh, the dresser drawers here, the cabinets. We need a bath so bad. We are gross. We haven't showered in like three weeks. And I got the money. I need someone else to bathe me. Probably, I wonder if this is going to wash out the pomade from my hair. Would you like help in here? Yep. Deluxe bath. Sure, Let's do it. Wonderful. Don't you worry about a thing. Oh boy. Hope I'm not scrubbing too hard. You'll be clean as a whistle. Gotta take a break sometime. That's too short. Absolutely. Some parts of me probably ain't been this clean in months. Oh, gross. <laughs> oh, I'm not sure what to do with that. You might be the friendliest person I've met in this town. In this place, I ain't surprised. So, what do you do when you're not working? Oh, I don't know. I'm learning to read lately. Number of times I nearly died the past few weeks, you wouldn't believe. I'm so very sorry to hear that. Are you married? Well, <laughs> wouldn't you like to know? That's enough small talk, I guess. All clean. Bet you wish I could stay longer, huh? Okay, I don't think I'm gonna get much cleaner than this. Thank you. Nice meeting you. Clean as a whistle. 
Look at that. Now we're going to get some good rest. A nice room. Hair tonic. Oh, so I guess hair tonic makes your hair grow faster? I have one, but I haven't used it yet. Oh, that cover was already open. That was a little glitchy. Oh, I don't want to change my wardrobe. Um, let's close the drawers, though. Let's look at the masks that we bought. We can do that. Okay. So we got the shotgun coat. That's kind of cool. That's the new thing. I don't want that coat. I guess that was the coat I already had on. I don't know. Shirts, everyday shirt. Change the color of it. Some paints, fancy paints. Ooh, look at those boots. Here's the masks. So no large mask. Executioner hood. Canvas sack. Oh my god, it looks like the strangers. Cloth mask. Metal skull mask. Psycho mask. None of those. Gun belts. Upgraded gun belt. Primary holsters. Upgraded holster. Offhand holster. Bandanas. Ooh. Satchels. The effects of all own satchels are active no matter which satchel is equipped. Cool. I haven't made any talismans yet, so... Nothing. Outfits. We're gonna do the uh, the gambler. That's the one I like. Pursuer. This one's cool too. The innocent. The rebel I don't like. The ruffian. Brawler's outfit. The grizzly's outlaw. This outfit is suitable for average temperatures. The winter. So it's suitable for cold, so I have that on the horse. The summer, so this is for the hot. If I'm in an extremely hot area. So I pretty much have this one, which is my main. And then I've got a, a hot and a cold outfit on uh, on my horse. But that's it. I think it's time to go to bed. We're going to sleep until morning. Oh my god. It's that late already. All right, guys. We're going to go ahead and end it here just as Arthur Morgan is going to take a well-needed rest for quite some time. Um, I do not know when I'll be streaming next. I'll be trying to do some as much as I can because I will be streaming until the end of December with a very rarity of maybe in January. Um, but I have some special streams in mind for December. Obviously, we're going to be having... Um, 
Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. So we could do a community stream if you guys have that as well. Um, but yeah, look forward to some future rest of my streams. Thank you so much for watching. Tune in next time.